hello friends today we will see how to connect Wi-Fi on Jetson Nano uh, we will use Intel 8265 NGW Wi-Fi module for this it is a 802.11 AC it has Bluetooth also so let's see how to connect and run let's get started so first of all you have to remove these two screws let's remove these screws so now we have removed these two screws from this module now you can just pull these two plastic bar just outside and it will just pop up as you can see and just pull a little bit and you can see that this is the Jetson nano module and here is a 64 GB SD card now you can see this is our M2 E port where we can attach our Intel 8265 Wi-Fi plus Bluetooth module so now we will just open this Intel Wi-Fi module it is this much tiny and let just here you can see it's written 8265NGW it's a Intel model number And these are the antenna for that module and after that we will attach this 7 dbi antenna to this module okay let's connect it so before connecting we have to remove this screw then and then you can fit Intel module because they have given some slot over here to fit on Jackson module. So to remove that you have to change your screw module. Now we can remove this and we will place our Intel module over here here you can see we have given dedicated slot for this so you can put it like this just press it and fit this screw again so now the screw will hold this module you can place your antenna from here now last fit our Jetson nano card it's very easy just press it and it will just connect back as you can see it's very easy so before proceeding further we will again fit these screws Mm. 
now we are ready to mount this Jetson on its case so this is a 3d print printed Jetson nano case I will give link for this 3d file where you can download and you can print it on your own it's freely available now let's put it so after connecting this case 3d printed case you can pull out your antenna from here now just connect this 70 bay antenna to this small antenna Now uh, Jetson Nano is ready with Intel Wi-Fi module. Just place this upper case. Now you can see our Jetson Nano is ready with the Wi-Fi and Bluetooth. Yeah. So now we will check Wi-Fi on LED screen. So now that we have connected our antenna to Jetson module, so before power ring up, if we have 5 volt 4 ampere power jack, then make sure you have connected this 2 pin jumper over here. So connect your 5 volt 4 ampere power jack with HDMI and this one I am using for my mouse and keyboard. So after powering up Jackson Nano, we can see that uh, Wi-Fi symbol is coming over here and you can see the Wi-Fi network it is showing. You can connect this so here I will connect this to my Wi-Fi network and you can see connection established let's check internet access from Chromium web browser mm, search working mm, you can see Wi-Fi is working so it's a Intel 8265 NGW Wi-Fi module and it is compatible with our Jetson Nano so after connecting Wi-Fi over here uh, if you have uh, application like you are not going to use HDMI to Jetson Nano every time in your project so for that I was facing I was facing some problem that um, after restarting my Jetson Nano uh, my Nano is not automatically connected to Wi-Fi network so if you have similar kind of application then you can add this uh, uh, this line sudo and name CLI to Jetson Nano and replace this uh, network and password with your own Wi-Fi network and after this uh, you can see uh, our Jetson module automatically connected to Wi-Fi network 
whatever we have configured over here That's it. Thank you for watching. See you next time.